for watching KHQA This Morning. It's your news now. 516, we're going to check in with our friend Kristen Aguirre, who's out and about one foot on the pedal, one foot in the grave this morning. Kristen? <laughs> I sure am. I'm here at Scotty's Fun Spot <laughs> testing out their new state-of-the-art go-kart track. And coming up later in the show, we'll hear why they decided to build this. And I'm even going to jump in a go-kart and take it for a spin around. Ooh, oh, pedal to the metal. Jealous. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Putting that lead foot to good use. <laughs> Right. Just kidding. I hope no no police officer are watching. <laughs> <laughs> if they are, they know where to find you now. Let's get Christina Geary is a, a Need for Speed this morning. A big NASCAR race this weekend in Phoenix. Yeah, she's getting ready to try out a different kind of racetrack, though. Kristen, how's it going? It's going good. I'm here at Scotty's Fun Spot. And later in the show, we are going to try out their new go-kart system. But right now, we're going to hear from Jeff Scotty. Why did you guys decide to make this? Uh, this was something that was in our original plans. Uh, we knew that racing in this uh, community was big and everybody loves to ride go-karts so we thought it was important. And this is kind of the closest one for here in the Tri-States for us because the there's two other ones but they're pretty far. They're farther away um, and we've had people that have been on go-karts at other places for say um, what do I want to say Branson mm -hmm. and they say hands down ours are better so ah. I like to hear that. <laughs> well you guys kind of have a unique track here. Um, I think from the highway you look over it kind of just looks flat but look at all the curves. Yes a lot of elevation change, uh, hairpin corners. Uh, it's an 820 foot track and uh, everybody loves it. And you you and your family are you guys are big racers too. You don't race go-karts but you guys race something else. Well we no we race go-karts. Oh the other go-karts. Uh, I have two kids eight and ten years old and mm -hmm. myself and we race go-karts uh, here in Springfield and St. Louis so um, not at this track but uh, yes yeah, so go-karting is something we like to do. <laughs> and so was it exciting for you guys to kind of bring your hobby now into work? Not that Scotty's fun spot is the most behind the desk kind of occupation. Yes um, like I said we love to do go-karting, so, and everybody does, so <laughs> it's, it's nice to see everybody have, have fun doing it. All right, well, coming up later in the show, I'm going to take Jeff on, and we are going to take a race around the track. Oh, Ooh. you're going to challenge again, huh? Oh. Oh, yeah. All I'm going right. to win this time. Okay. I am. <laughs> Good luck. We'll, we'll see. A lot of NASCAR <laughs> racers got to Go speed stuff. racer, go, but mm -hmm. go, Kristen Aguirre, go. Go, go, and go. How's it going, Kristen? It's going good. So before I get out on the track, I want to learn a little bit about the car that I'm going to be driving. Scotty's Fun Spot has a new state-of-the-art go-kart system. So what kind of cars do we have here, Jeff? These are all electric powered go-karts. Um, they have equivalent to a 16 horsepower uh, Honda motor. So everybody thinks electric is slow. Actually, they're faster. Oh, so when people get on here, they're going to be getting some good speed. And also, we were talking a little bit about um, you guys monitor the speed. So for parents that maybe are afraid of their kid getting in here, don't really, no need to worry. Right. Um, we actually have three different speed levels for different age kids. Uh, kids as young as 46 inches can drive them. The seats are adjustable so they can still reach the pedals. Uh, but what we really like this technology is they all have a boost button, so you get two five-second boosts for a race, um, so you can actually pass while you're out there riding. Wow, and you guys have also taken the time to really train your staff and how to monitor the speed and, and monitor everything else out on the track. Yes, um, I mean, we want to keep it safe for everybody, so uh, there's a lot of uh, that the operator can do as far as stopping people if there's somebody that's spun out. Um, actually, they can back up cars. If somebody's completely going the wrong direction, they can stop them and back them up from inside the pit area here. So there are there are some restrictions as to how old people can be when they get into this car? Yes, we do have height requirements and um, age requirements. So I'm sure I meet the age requirements, but am I going to meet the height requirements? We have to go over there and measure you to make sure. <laughs> All right, well, coming up later in the show, I'm going to jump in one of these cars, and me and Jeff are going to race it out. But before that, during break, I'm going to go measure to make sure I can even get into one of these cars. Have you picked your favorite car yet? Have Racing Jeff fun. Gordon, it looks like, although Ooh. she's uh, Juan Pablo Montoya. Well, and Jeff Scott, so Jeff, <laughs> Jeff, I guess it's the yeah, same thing. Yeah, we... Okay. <laughs> well, we are here at Scotty's Fun Spot. We are testing out their newest go-kart system. So we are taking a little tutorial before Jeff and I get our race on. So, Jeff, what are some tips that you give everyone uh, before? Some tips that we have for the track. Um, a lot of tight corners, so you have to be uh, a little aggressive in some of the corners. Uh, 
The other thing is the boost button, it takes a few second delay, so you have to time those just right in order to pass somebody. There are a couple good passing places, so you have to time those just right. Drive side by side all the way around the track and race, so there's and, plenty of room. And you guys kind of have a unique racetrack. It's not just one straight around. Right. Uh, a lot of bank corners. I think there's 11 corners all together, and um, it's, it's fun. What are some tips you would give me for racing you later? Stay close to the insides on the corners and keep the pedal down. <laughs> Don't lose the brake. And so I'm going up against some stiff competition because you know all about racing. Yes. I've been around a few go-kart tracks in my time. So, <laughs> um, so and then this is on on the actual um, steering wheel. It says boost, no bumping. So these are go-karts. They're not meant for hitting each other. Right. Uh, no bumping, and, and the attendant has has the ability to slow you down if you're bumping. And uh, of course we have bumper cars, so if you want to bump, go ride the bumper cars. <laughs> All right, well, coming up later in the show, Jeff and I are going to get our race on. And I have a feeling after a few practice rounds, I'm going to win, Jeff. <laughs> well, best of luck. <laughs> yeah. In the race to the chase. <laughs> There. Kristen Thanks. Aguirre is live this morning. She's out and about learning how to put her pedal to the metal. How's it going, Kristen? It's going good, and now's the time to get our race on. So Jeff and I are going to go ahead and see who's the fastest seed racer here. I'm hoping it's me. So we're going to go on the count of three. One, two, three. Ah! All right, so now we're rounding the corners here. It is a little bit scary how fast these go. I'm trying to go as fast as I can, but Jeff is right on my tail. I have a feeling he's gonna pass me. Ah! <laughs> these are definitely harder to drive than they look. I am, these corners are really tight, so I'm trying to keep control of it as fast as much as I can. I'm pretty scared. Uh, and uh, oh my gosh, I won. I have a feeling Jeff let me win, but that was a lot of fun. What kind of ideas went into this, and why you guys decided to bring this to Scotty's? Um, just we knew that everybody loves go karts, whether it's kids or adults. Uh, so. We're glad to bring it to the area. <laughs> All right, well, if you're interested in going to get your pedal to the metal, make sure you check out Scotty's Fun Spot. <laughs> nice job, Kristen. Yes, congratulations to you. <laughs> Thanks, Jeff. We've been out at uh, Scotty's Fun Spot all morning. Racing yeah. cars came out the victor this morning against Jeff Scott, the owner yes. and race fan himself. Congratulations, Kristen. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I know, I'm a speed demon. But of course, there's a big thanks to Jeff for actually letting me win. He let me have my glory. <laughs> um, so Jeff, what was one of the reasons that you guys decided to build this? Um, we, we decided to bring um, go-karts to the community just because it is a racing community between Quincy Raceways and TNT and West Quincy. And everybody likes to ride go-karts, so we knew it was a fun and exciting thing. And this is kind of one of the closest ones to this area of the Tri-States. Yes, um, closest one's probably two hours away from us, mm -hmm. and I like to say ours is bigger and better. So. <laughs> and so for some parents that may be a little bit nervous with their kids getting into these go-karts, they don't really need to worry. They don't need to worry. Um, we have three different speed levels and age levels, so they correspond with a 10-year-old can go to a certain speed, and they're all at the same speed. And we also have the ability to stop them, and if we have to help somebody off the ride, we can do that. So At the same time, these aren't made for the little, little, little kids. Right. Um, we do have, they, top speed is 25 miles an hour um, with the boost button, so they're for big kids too. <laughs> and so if people want to come out here and try some of these race cards, when can they see them? Um, we're open 9 a.m. to uh, 11 p.m. on the weekends, and pretty much as long as it's not raining and snowing, we'll be open this winter. Um, and you guys have been open since you guys opened about two weeks ago, and the last few weeks, if you remember, we had some really cold days, yeah, but we, that didn't stop. We, uh, we were running last Saturday night when it was uh, mid-30s, and it was cold, um, so I would imagine any colder than that would be closed <laughs> for the winter, but um, we're still here. All right, well, if you are interested in taking on some of these go-karts, make sure you check them out this weekend, especially with this great weather. And just in case you missed earlier when they were racing, there's lights yeah. on the golf on the golf carts, on the go karts, so they can. Uh, <laughs> and they have cool sound going on throughout the race. I don't know if you guys were able to hear that when I was um, when I was in the car, but you know it makes you feel very NASCAR-ish. So I felt like cool. I was a speed demon. Very nice. <laughs>